UCD is the largest engineering school in Ireland and we attract among the best students to study engineering here in Ireland and also the most diverse cohort of students. We have a very large ratio of female to male students, non-EU students to EU students and visiting students from abroad and mature students. And that diversity is one of the strengths of our programmes. We take 300 students in in first year and there are two things that we try to emphasise in first year. Most importantly, we want to ensure that all of our students are very strong on the fundamentals of engineering. So they study things like mechanics, mathematics, physics and chemistry. We want to make sure that they are able to work collaboratively as teams in design activities. And the diverse cohort of students means that the innovation activities that our students do is naturally much more diverse. And that's a positive. In addition to lectures, laboratories and tutorials, we place a lot of emphasis on learning by doing, active learning and project-based learning in all of our modules. And we do this right from semester one. And this actually equips our students with a good balance between the theory and the application of that theory through practical-based activities. The assignment that you're going to see here this evening is an illustration of one of those in my own modules. The challenge I've set them tonight is that they have to build a crane that is able to carry a weight of one kilogram and they've got to use recycled materials. I give them a very flexible brief in that they have to be imaginative, innovative and work in small groups of five students per team. So basically we use down pipes from a, from a house and then a, a wooden support at the bottom just to hold it all together and we have a fulcrum point here so when you push down here it lifts up the weights. The lightest crane with the biggest thing it could lift was really the winner so it's giving a competitive aspect while working together as a team to design a project which just is a fundamental piece of engineering. Our crane was built out of cardboard and duct tape and it ended up withstanding a weight of 60 newtons and we thought it would only withstand like 40 so that worked out really well. Our crane is basically looks like more as a real crane built out of wood. We try to implement all our mechanics theories that we've studied during the semester. One of the things that I look for in this assignment is that they apply the theoretical work that we've done in lectures uh, in this assignment. From lectures we learned all about forces and moments and how um, if an object stays in equilibrium all the forces are the same on either end of the crane which is what we tried to do. We tried to balance the forces on either side. It's great to see in practice how vectors work and how forces cancel out which is what a lot of cranes are all about about having a force that counters the force of gravity. So uh, it's just good to actually see it in practice. It's kind of difficult when there's just diagrams on the board and trying to understand those. When you're actually putting the crane together, it's a completely different experience. You kind of see what you're actually doing with your calculations. This design challenge allowed us to um, put the things we studied in lectures, like the forces and strength of materials and those kind of things, um, into practice on a physical object. I really do like the practical side of engineering. It helps me learn more. It's easy to um, lose focus in lectures and not necessarily be able to apply it, whereas when you're building and working in groups, it's a lot more applicable to what engineering is actually going to be outside of school. We take it as a given that when they've got a very solid foundation for the fundamentals, they have the ability to work collaboratively in multidisciplinary teams and to be very innovative in design and uh, innovation activities. Over the course of the challenge, I'd say, first of all, our communications definitely have improved. And the biggest way they've improved is that we have a better sense of what everyone wants to do in terms of uh, the project. Working as a team was uh, it was good because we were able to share the workload and um, you'd come up with ideas that you wouldn't come up with by yourself. So that's a major benefit from working as a team. I really enjoyed the practical side of engineering in UCD. Um, we get put into groups for not only this module, but um, we have other modules as well where we do practical group work. And that involves building um, physical structures and it really helps you to understand the um, applications of the things that we learn in the lectures. These students are Ireland's best engineering students. After they finish here in first year, they'll go on to study many, many different branches of engineering. They'll go on to be the leaders of industry here in Ireland and internationally. It's nice to be able to do it and um, actually experience the engineering. Um, I'm not sure which engineering pathway I'll choose just yet, but it's um, projects like these really give you a taste for the different, um, the different streams. So the best thing about making this project, I'd have to say, was spending time with the lads, doing up <laughs> design ideas, drinking lots of tea as well.